All right, guys, how's it going out there? Rooster here in Tennessee. Got a little uh, combination video today, and uh, both these pieces are uh, pending sold. Just uh, customers waiting to see a video and waiting on me to send an invoice to them. I told them uh, not to worry about paying until I actually got a video done. So Cobra 25 LTD, uh, RC did this one up. It's got a Ranger Echo Board over here, your dual control knobs for that. And then it's got a variable power in the back over here. So if you turn it that way, that way, it's going to be turning the variable power up, the dead key up. This way, it's going to turn the uh, dead key down. Uh, we'll do an output test on the radio first, and then we'll uh, get into testing the amp. Um, has a power tune, power mod, whatever you want to call it. Basically a brand new radio. Uh, he had done this one up for a uh, local. They ended up kind of getting out of it a little bit, so uh, they were thinning some stuff out, and it never really even got used. Still has the uh, painter's tape on it here, so... Uh, I've got a radio on the background, Cobra 90, so you guys can hear the echo board working. Ranger echo board in here. Hello, audio, one, two, hello, audio, one, two, audio. Show you that it receives. That's just keying up the Cobra 90 in the background. We'll go ahead and turn the echo off. And uh, we're on our mic gain about three o'clock. Let's check our uh, output. We got a 50 watt slug in here right now, so we're looking at the middle scale. Audio. It's about a two watt dead key, swinging about seven and a half, eight watts average. And we're on 14.8 volts for our test voltage. And then uh, PEP. Audio one two three. Audio one two three. Audio one two three. Audio. One, two, three. audio, audio actually does better just talking into it than it does audio and audio one two three audio one two three audio one two three audio about 35 and if you audio you know 28 30 watts pep uh we can turn the variable all the way up and see what it goes up to About six and a half, seven watts audio one two three audio one two three audio doesn't make a difference on the output on the uh, peak, go to average, audio, you know, still about eight. Now, when we turn the key all the way down, we will lose some average power. Let's go all the way down with it. Oh, so about seven all the way down from a zero watt dead key. So dead key goes from zero, basically, or very little, up to uh, six and a half, seven. Go ahead and turn the amp on. And what we'll do, we'll just... Uh, We'll run this thing up to about a 65 watt dead key or so. This is a one drive and two, um, no name, ass kicker, whatever you want to call it. Stickman built this uh, way back when. He is, uh, he's, de he's deceased now. He's passed away. Uh, he was a very popular builder when he was, uh, when he was alive. So uh, rest in peace to uh, Stickman. I've had several of his amps come through here. Uh, this one has HG2879s in it, and I believe it has a 2290 in the uh, driver section. I'm not 100% sure I haven't had it apart, but I can see the HG2879s through the top. And it's the uh, three pound mall, he called them. It's a, a one drive and two. So uh, we'll check it out, see how this combination runs together. I think this makes a good combo because this radio is not really a big powerhouse. And it would probably be about what you want to run into this. You don't need to drive something really, really hefty into this uh, because it does just have HG2879s in the output section. So. Uh, it's not going to take a whole, whole lot of drive to make this thing get up and go. So a nice large cabinet. I mean, it's in a, a five pill cabinet. That's typically how he built them. He, uh, he used larger cabinets than required. So uh, not surprised to see that at all. Get our clamp meter situated over here. And uh, let's just throw a dead key. Uh, let's take the slug out first. Let's see if we've got a thousand out over here. 500, 2,500. Put my thousand up. Let's see. Uh, do, do, do. All right, we got our thousand. Let's put that in there, and we'll just roll our dead key up until we get a decent carrier. There we go. Whoop. Don't go crazy with it. That's about 65, 70 watts on a dead key. Variable's wide open. Hello, are you? Are you? Are you? About 200 bars. 
and that's with uh, what seven seven watts eight watts average going in Let's see how much is drawing Ooh, 36 36 amps Ooh. check PEP this is gonna be peak Ooh, are you 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 uh, 500 PEP audio one two three audio check one two three audio one two three audio audio one two three audio one two three audio one two three audio one two three audio getting up there about 40 amps this radio like I said it talks better than it uh, audios so uh, 500 PEP it's got a switch back here on the back I don't know if it's got sideband delay in it or not let's see if I can find it without looking Oop, bird cheat let's see there it is I can't tell any difference. I think that was supposed to be a sideband delay, but uh, there's no difference whether the switch is up or whether it's down. Let's turn the uh, variable back to halfway here. Hello, audio. Boy, that really cuts it down. Audio, check, one, two, three. Audio, one, two. Audio, check, 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 check. About 180 PEP all the way down, or at halfway, rather. And then all the way down, audio. And I'll do jack. Let's come up to 9 o'clock. Audio, doing a little. 12 o'clock, audio, about 180, 3 o'clock, audio, 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 what, 400 and some change, and then back to wide open, audio, 1, 2, 3, 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 audio. about 500 PEP, so be a nice running little combo if you ask me, I think that'll work out just fine, again, it's a uh, pending sold, just want to do a video on it and uh, let him check it out here before he paid me for it. It's got dual uh, power leads coming out the back too, so uh, it really did, did really did overkill on this amp. You got your dual grounds and dual hots coming out there. A lot of movement with the fan, not a super loud fan on it. Good running amp. He's actually got a 16 pill, so uh, funny, he had sent me a picture. I think he sent me a picture of his 16 or told me that he has 16 that a uh, stick man had built. And uh, a couple of days later, I traded for this thing, and uh, he was the first person that came to mind. So, uh, probably make a really, really nice box to run into his uh, run into his 16. You just don't want to overdrive it. Like I said, this radio right here, probably the perfect combination. Um, that's why I wanted to sell the two together. Uh, that way, it kind of set somebody up for success. Um, this radio, this amp, uh, should be a really killer little combo together. And he may sell the radio, ditch it, and use something else. I don't know. Um, but if he chooses to run them together, they will be a nice talking, a uh, nice talking combo. Cobra 25 LTD Classic <laughs> done up by RC, and a uh, Stickman Ass Kicker three pound mall one driving two. Appreciate it, guys. Questions, comments, shoot me a text four two three two nine nine three five three five Rooster in Tennessee. See you bye.